The one I wanted to go over was the very first one. Uh, we have a rectangle. What are the dimensions of it, Lamani? X minus 1 and X plus 3. X minus 1 and X plus 3. What's the other piece of information we're given, Tevin? That, is, that the area is 32 inches. Good. Area is 32 inches squared. Nice. Glad you included the units. Now, how do we find the area of a rectangle like this? Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Chelsea, your hand was up in your mind, I could tell. Um, that's exactly right. So, yeah, that's exactly right. We'd multiply our length times our width. That x minus 1 times our x plus 3 is equal to 32. Now, uh, you guys are, are foil champions. I don't want to waste your time by doing that. When you foiled it out, Anj, what'd you get? Okay, we're not finished though. What do we need to do? Yeah, no, we're gonna pick on you. Me? Yeah, you. Okay, what do we have? Which is? Okay. Great. So now I'm gonna look for factors of negative three that no, add. No, no. Yeah. Factors of C that add up to B. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Terry. Oh, so what do I need to do in order to make this equal to zero? Okay, so I subtract 32 from both sides of the equal sign. 32 minus 32 is, ah, now we're there. Negative 3 minus 32. We were three steps from zero. We took 32 more steps from zero. Where do we end up? Yeah, good. Okay, so Jody, help us out now. We're going to be looking for what in order to solve for x here? Good, so give me numbers. 